Hello everyone, my name is Jio Shin, presenting on development of nanosage carbide dispersed advanced radiation resistance, Austin in stainless steels for generation four system. I am a candidate for the PhD in Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology with a major in nuclear materials engineering. Before the introduction of my research, I have to say that it is really thankful to give me an opportunity to present my research in this Generation 4 International Forum. Our principal challenge in the development of the Gen 4 nuclear reactor is the discovery of advanced structural material that can endure extreme environments. Indeed, our Gen 4 reactor concept plays a very high burden on core materials which will have to withstand high operating temperature, intense fast neutron flux, and contact with the corrosive environments. Furthermore, the objective of, uh, objective of the Gen 4 program include extended design lifetime to 60 years, increased fuel burn-up and the cycle length as compared to current reactor. As a result, the maximum radiation dose for in-core material could exceed 200 dPa. Currently, variety martensic steels are being considered as a candidate for internal material comparing with the and stainless steel because of their lower thermal expansion, higher thermal conductivity, and higher radiation tolerance. In particular, the swelling resistance of FN steels is much better than and stainless steel in general. However, these materials have been known to susceptible to a DBTT, which causes lower fracture toughness and failed by brittle fracture at room temperature. Moreover, most FM steels have lower high temperature oxidation resistance compared to Austin and stainless steel. Austin and stainless steel also have been extensively used in the past as a first candidate material of sodium fast reactor hexagonal wrapper tube. However, the poor swelling resistance is one of the reasons why an Austin stainless steel was remitted in Gen 4 system. Therefore, to overcome these drawbacks, as shown in right-hand side figure, our research group developed a nano carbide dispersed advanced radiation resistant Austin stainless steel by using a controllable thermal mechanical processing to inhibit Voice swelling, the strategies mainly focus on introducing high density of effective defects sink of nanosized carbide, which enhance absorption and recombination of radiation induced vacancies and in interstitials. And through the newly designed TMP based on the conventional industrial steel making method, the average diameter and volumetric number density of the niobium carbide are in few nanometer size and order of 10 to the 22 to 10 to the 23 per cubic meter respectively. Finally, to evaluate the radiation resistance, newly designed, uh, developed alloy were compared to commercial 316 stainless steels and FMS alloy in terms of void swelling. As shown in the right bottom side figure, the swelling resistance of the RS alloy was much better than 316 stainless steel and comparable to FMS alloy. Therefore, the, uh, re the research suggests that nanosized niobium carbide precipitate can act as effective sink site and the RS alloy would be a promising material for Gen 4 system. Thank you for your time and attention.